we had decided to do a card game. I don't even remember what card game it was at that point. I have no idea what we were playing. But we realized how much of it was life skills, Uh the communication piece. Yes, it's games like Go Fish, and it's sorting and sequencing. Mm -hmm. You know, there's just hundreds of little bits about teaching and learning and growing as a person that come through playing a game of cards. And you can teach math in a way that doesn't have to be difficult either. (laughs) Mm -hmm. We were playing cards, and they were sitting in there yelling snap at each other, but really they were just completely Mm -hmm. motivated and just sitting there and playing and loving it. Mm -hmm. And and I said to Francis, I need to write this down. And I'm sitting there with a post-it note going, writing down ideas of things I could do with the kids next. And that was when I said, let's write a book, ha, ha, ha. That is one thing that makes being a teacher in this school the most incredible thing because you know that that there are funds out there to nurture and support what you want to do as a teacher to be the best teacher that you can be. And that this just doesn't happen everywhere. Mm -hmm. If, If people are kind enough to give money for the teachers to do that, the people who are going to benefit are the children and the families who are here, and, and, and that's just fantastic because I don't think that anything that we do is wasted on the children because we always come back with something that we're going to use, and they benefit. It's not like throwing money away. 